Hi, Mayor Ezra here, and I have a special message for you. I understand, and I don't suggest anyone should do anything illegal. Now, without being said, I think the real danger, without derogating from all the other dangers on Earth, is fear. It is hysteria. It is losing our core values of love, tolerance, understandings, and exchange. I want to ask you, what is more important? Freedom? or health, love or health, being unchained or being healthy, the majority or the one. Losing sight of these questions is dangerous. Death, viruses are not dangerous. They were always there, will always be there, and they will win only if we lose our freedom to be human, only if we happily agree to give up our urge to be free, to do, to dare, to expand despite the danger, and to never agree to being caged and controlled and made to be afraid for any reason. I'm willing to die for my country and for my freedom and for the greatest good to the greatest number of people or things. And that willingness to look into the eyes of fear and raise above it, regardless of the price, is what makes me human. And that's what carried human to now. That willingness made human overcome all the challenges in the past. Have a look. Have a look at all those life forms that are not with us any longer. They have one thing in common. They decided they cannot handle a real or imagined enemy, a danger, and so they retreated to the extinction. It is not the enemy that killed them but their fear, the unwillingness to confront danger, the heat. Are you going to hide or are you going to fight? Now fighting does not mean being reckless. It means facing the danger. It means continuing to progress despite all invitations to do otherwise. It means continuing to keep human values above all. It means never giving up what makes you human. Fear, hysteria, cowardice is not what makes human human. Courage, love, ideas, life and death is what makes human human. If you are not willing to fight for what is right, you are not living. And what is right never includes fear. Right never includes running away. Right never includes hiding. And for sure, right never includes losing your freedom. Your immediate life is not as important as your freedom, as your values, as otherwise, why would anyone ever go to war to protect his family, his land, his country, or his beliefs? You cannot be afraid and free. Fear is an unwillingness to communicate, so it is almost always true that what you're afraid of does not exist. So my suggestion for you, my friend, is ignore all invitations to be afraid as those are never true. Welcome invitations to communicate and act. All improvements are the result of progressing against all odds. Expand, never retract. Communicate, never hide. And be so certain that the virus shivers when it looks at you. With love from me to you. Mayor Ezra, thank you for listening.